Welcome back, guys. Skirko here with Abstract Damon. Once again, bringing you some Resident Evil 7 gameplay. Uh, continuing our walkthrough from where we left off. Exactly from where we left off. Is that footsteps I hear? Guys, this game's soundtrack is extremely creepy. So, for the next one, you go into the room I've not been in yet. Stand. Look at the board of the door. Take your, once again, your finger. Point at the door. Once again, you get a little interaction. Sounds like a door been rumbling. Give it a second, then you can close out of it. Immediately walk out, press down and B or circle if you're on the PS4. Do a quick turn, and you can hear the next laugh. All right, guys. After you do that, then you have to make your way back up to the attic. And uh. I actually thought you had to go to the basement for a second. I forgot this part. But you need to go up, up to the attic. Go once again over to the bed. You can see these wires and stuff up top. Take the finger and point it that way. Once again, you get the next part. And guys, after each of these things right here where you got to point the finger, you can then go to your book and you have another little store here. As you can see... Phil's tucked in tight on his cold, stiff bed. He's having sweet dreams of not being dead. Stanley was not to go hide and they'd seek, but they wouldn't let him out no matter how much he shrieked. Marlene was so proud of her white and blue necklace, it made her feel tall and left her quite breathless. Alright, so then after that, you go to the telephone here. You answer the phone. Wrong number. He'll hang it up for you. Then head back down to the basement. So I did not know about this part. I was always told you had to go to the VHS tape and interact with it. But this is my first attempt trying it this way. If it works, then I'll probably go uh, uh, beat myself up off camera. Maybe on camera if you guys want to see that. Poll started. Who wants to see JJ beat himself up? Alright guys, so like I said, go back down to the basement, into the creepy room that may or may not have more monsters in it later. Yeah. And there's a doll on the floor. And she should laugh for you. Alright guys. So, if that don't work, we have to go into the VHS tape. So here we go. Go upstairs into the spawn room where you originally spawned into the game. And... If you guys are new and don't know what a VHS is, it's an old uh, device player that would play a thing that we called VHS tapes or cassettes. Some people don't say it's, I think that's right. This is the VCR, guys, for all you, uh, youngins. Put the VHS tape that we found earlier in the wardrobe in, and you go into the video. Magic. Like Harry Potter. Or Poltergeist. Say yes. I'm going to show me watching the tape one time, and then, you know, I'll go and I'll tell how many times it actually takes for it to work. But, um, I'll also show you... I also show you a few things that some people think it takes for you know this this secret thing to happen. Um, so there is a secret part of this this VHS tape here. There is a secret ghost who shows up in a few different locations. I've seen most of them except for for one location. I have them all recorded except for two. One of the locations is right there. Like we always well, do. There is on zoom in button, but she's usually right there on, in the bushes. You'll see her standing and facing away from you. Um, <coughs> that's the first location she can be. Um, thankfully, though, uh, you know you can still see her all the way until you enter a new area. So once we enter into this door, she will not pop up here. It will be the next location 
which is kind of a creepy spot. It's behind you. Um, I'm more likely not going to see her here, but I will cut to a clip that shows where she will be. Also, I'll draw a circle right here where she'll stand, and I may try to find a picture that shows exactly where she is there. Uh, so thanks to the power of the internet. This time? You ever so, What's the, the time I've got her to pop up, I walked down here before them haunted? and did a quick turn. And there she was, hanging down over top of the door. Fuck. It was actually pretty I creepy. Anchor, you know? uh, sub, <coughs> it probably won't be creepy anchor. for What's you, that? where it's not really happening to you, because it didn't really scare my sister, but it was pretty cool when I experienced Sorry, it. Andre. Hopefully, I see her in one of the other places I've not got recorded, if not both of them, because it is possible for her to pop in in two places place or more in the VHS tapes. So hopefully we can get those last Nancy, two places. Get a shot of this. So the next area, once you enter the kitchen, is so, uh, the window beside the microwave. On the PS4, I, I got her to pop up here, but none on the Xbox back. One version. A lot of bad rumors about their son, Lucas. Bad seat, apparently. I hope you guys can hear me well. These guys are speaking pretty loudly. Ah, shit! I know I should have worn my good shoes. What'd you step on? There's nothing there. Oh, shit. Oh, man, I wish you'd pop up. Glad I had my shots. Although... I, I have I until we leave off. this area. Andre, what do you think? It's going to scare me to death if she pops up with me being Andre? this close. Andre, where are you? Quit turn. Andre. Whew, my heart's beating fast Andre. just just knowing that's possible. Lancy, you see where Andre went? <coughs> Excuse me. Where is he? All right, so let's go see. The next area is right on the added stairs. This is the last time I work with that guy. She's not there. I mean, producers, they come and go. Once again, guys, I will circle all the places like you, and put a little clip of where Just they are uh, over the video. So I'm not going to say them now, but you guys should. With the power of editing. See, I don't know exactly where she spawns at in here. This is the next area. the Actually, the final area she can be. And supposedly, if you see her, what the fuck was that? then Did you the secret will work. But it's not. It's not 100%. Uh, I've seen her in not just one place, but two places in the VHS Andre? tape. And the, the secret still not happened. So is that is not um, the requirement. It may help the chances. It just, that's not the requirement for it. Andre, where are you, man? There's another thing that people theorize that I will show you once I'm out of the VHS tape that it takes to happen. Hopefully it works first try, though. That'd be sweet. I've had it work a second try. I've had it work fifth try. And then yesterday, I was like, wait, like over ten tries. It is annoying. But I really want that uh, that secret item in the um, me. excuse me in the in the full version. All right, new deal. Climb down the ladder, <coughs> so guys. This is some weird, some real Blair Rich Project stuff. If you've never watched the the movie, at the end of it, this is pretty much what it looks like. They find a guy staring at the wall. But in the movie, there was no guy with the post shut in his throat. So, you know, they had to change it up a little bit. Can't steal all the right ideas. Guys, this, this demo is really fun. Um, uh, there, you know, this is full of spoilers, so you probably don't want to watch it before you play the game. But it, it's real fun. There's another demo before this, which cut out a lot of the stuff. But, um... Okay, the other thing to theorize is you have to read this letter. I shall dash you... Against the stones. And what looks like a picture of Abe Lincoln mixed with Mr. Magoo. I've never noticed that picture before. I mean, I've noticed the picture, but I've never noticed the, the similarities with the, the 16th president and the uh, the old um, line comedy cartoon. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so then we once again have to head back downstairs to the area that creeps me out because I'm not 100 sure the monster doesn't respawn. <laughs> Alright guys, when you finally hear the laughter, which <coughs> however many times it takes, once you finally hear it, jump for joy because you finally did it. Um, 
you head back upstairs, head toward the kitchen, and go through all these doors. Don't worry, they close themselves behind so you don't have to turn around and catch that draft in your butt. You go in here, raise the lid off the pot, and once again go through the cockroach scene. Take your finger, point it down in there for the last, last thing you gotta do guys. It's, it's over, you're done. Don't turn the game off yet though. You still have to go upstairs to the attic. Let's, we'll go ahead and read the note right quick. See what the final letter says. Timmy did not mind the harsh light of four sons. Eyes of choir heads and he didn't have one. So nice little creepy Aesop's Fable fairy tale here. So let's go to the attic and collect our reward. We're going to get something in the final game. Hey, that is stupid door. Alright guys, so there is a door here that's been locked the entire time until you finish. Until you finish doing all the secrets. And now look at this. It's open. And a creepy rocking chair here. You're the best ever. Thank you. And right in the middle, the rusty coin. Dirty coin. <laughs> oh, and a creepy laugh. You can examine it. Nothing special to it. But it allows you to get the best ending there is. And to collect something in the final game. Now, all I do is climb out of the house. Civilization would go. Alright guys, that's all you gotta do. Do all that and you'll finally get the item when Resident Evil 7 comes out. There is a quicker way to do this. So expect a, a uh, what do you call that? A upcoming video to this one. A quicker way to do it. I didn't learn it until just now, so it's it's pretty new to me too, but it is much quicker, so it will save you time. Once again, guys, if you like the video, like, subscribe, share it with your friends. Guys, let's try to get 10 likes on this video. You guys have been doing awesome. I mean, I, I can't, can't you know, explain how much I appreciate you guys. Once again, guys, God bless, and don't forget to wow.